today. I'm in my craft room. You can see it's, it's kind of crazy. I do have a lot of, you can see there's all my fabric and just some random things and things I'm working on and on my couch over here I got a whole bunch of stuff that I'm working on. It's all kind of stacked up in the front of the couch that you can't see it because usually it's covered and yeah it's not not the prettiest of rooms but um, I thought you know what I would just see what this looks like you know in a video I don't know we'll just we'll see but um, anyway so I went to a Dollar Tree in Tennessee and it's a little bit bigger than the one we have here so they have a few more things than we do and I was hoping to find those new um, those new lotions and soaps and bath salts and body wash that everybody is hauling but they didn't have any I got some cute stuff at this Dollar Tree that I didn't find at my Dollar Tree so I went ahead and got these so let's dive into what I got first things first I got some pictures I have not seen these at my Dollar Tree but they did have them in the one in Tennessee and there were several of them like lots of them and so I just picked up a couple that I liked that were more my style and would look good in my house so here's the first one it says love all you need is love and family so it's like that song love all you need is love that one and it's got a little hanger on the back so you can hang it and the frame on this one is okay it's black so um, I think it's okay I think it's gonna go in my laundry room because my laundry room kind of has those colors in it the rest of my house has like navy so that's really not gonna go but in my laundry room it'll be cute so we live in a barn we converted a barn into a house and um, I didn't really want my house to be like country I didn't want it to be you know that kind of a look to it because even though it's a barn I just didn't want that to, I wanted people to come in and go oh my gosh this doesn't even look like a barn that's kind of what I was going for it's it's not there yet we've only been in here a year I guess and I've just slowly been doing stuff we have chickens though and I found this cute picture not that I'm gonna I don't know what I'm gonna do with it I may hang it on my chicken coop I don't know maybe something like that but I just thought it was cute so there it is it's a chicken it's a really cute chicken a rooster actually it's a rooster on there but we have we have chickens we do have two roosters but mostly we have chickens ours is farm to table in style we do eat the eggs they're fresh eggs they're organic ish so anyway I thought that was cute just because we have chickens this picture I got because it matches my kitchen stuff I don't like the frame so because it's kind of like this bronzy goldish funky I don't know I just don't like the frame so I'm gonna spray paint the frame but I like the picture see that it's cute it hangs this way but I'm gonna see if I can make no I guess the flower has to go yeah the flower has to go that way but I think I'm gonna hang it somewhere in my kitchen because I have another print on the wall that I got at Hobby Lobby and it's kind of the same look to it with the same colors so um, I thought I'd put this in the kitchen somewhere just to add to that picture so there's more color in the kitchen and my kitchen cabinets are like a blue they're like a navy they're they're much darker than navy than that but it pulls out the navy so okay and then this one is like a canvas this one's canvas happiness is homegrown all right well since we live on a farm we have homegrown stuff this is cute and it's in my kind of colors it's kind of those bright fun colors that I like I don't know where it's gonna go yet but it was so cute and it's like it's like can't see it's canvas now this right here I mean is a dollar so I mean obviously everything at Dollar Tree is a dollar you know that drives me crazy when everybody says oh it was a buck it was only a dollar so, yeah you're at the Dollar Tree everything's a dollar so but this one is really cute this one girl that I watch sometimes and she gets books at the Dollar Tree I've never looked at the books I usually get them at thrift stores and stuff because you can get them for like 25 cents but um, I just kind of scanned the Dollar Tree books today and I found this book and it's sugar savvy solution so get your energy up and weight down but it just has some good information here about sugar and I know sugar's not good for you I know you can have too much of it and I know a lot of fruits and stuff that I eat and it's got like recipes this one looks pretty good Ooh, portobello mushroom portobello cheesesteak that looks that looks really good I just ate lunch I know I, it's really late it's what it's 2.59 and I ate lunch like 30 minutes ago that's that's just what I do I don't eat lunch like normal days but it's got like all these recipes in here and like little exercises and stuff so yeah so I got this book I thought it was a really nice nice book and it's pink 
So yeah, my decor has pink in it. So sitting on my bookshelf, it'd be kind of cute because it's pink. So yeah, I got this little box. They've been out for a long time and I just kind of passed them up because I don't like bows. I'm not a big bow fan, but I can literally take that bow off and just have the cute box. I think I'm going to put it in here somewhere, maybe on one of those shelves back there. Like, maybe clean up one of those shelves and like put some of these. I'll probably go back and get a couple more. They had a teal one that I kind of liked. So I'll probably go back and get a teal so I can put like, little things on my shelf just to make it look a little neater and a little cuter. It always got to be cute. I mean, it can't always be functional. It's got to be cute too. I love owls. I think they're adorable. And so when I saw these stickers, I thought they were so cute and had to get them. They're, they're in pink, orange, purple, and teal. I do a prayer journal slash whatever we did at church that Sunday. I, like I write it on my bulletin and then I transfer it to this book. But I transfer it to the book with cute stickers and decorations so that it makes it a little more fun. It's just kind of like a devotional book of my own that I made instead of buying one. And um, I like cute stickers in it to make it look fun. So I got these. You could use these in um, those happy planners that everybody's doing. I don't do happy planners. I've said that before because I don't use planners. I don't really have a lot that I have to do to put in a planner. You know, the occasional appointment, but I just put it in my phone. Because if I put it in the calendar, I'm probably going to forget. So I have to put them in my phone. The other day I was there and I got a whole bunch of totes and little baskets to go into my utility room to hold all my stuff, my extra stuff. And um, they didn't have a whole bunch, like a whole big variety of styles, but the one in Tennessee had a whole big, huge variety of styles. These were there. They're those two colors that I love, the green and the blue, because I like things to match. Everything's got to match so it looks nice and cohesive, uniform, something like that. But these are a three pack. There's three in here, not two, like they crossed it out. See, there's three. So you get three for a dollar. What is that? 33.3 per 33.3 cents a piece. You cannot go wrong. And I actually needed this size to go in my utility closet. I had a couple things that I only had a few of and I didn't want to put them like with the soap or shampoo or something else. So these are a good little size to add to my utility room closet. They also had these. Same colors, because I love these two colors. These have lids though, so you can stack them. I can stack them in my utility room closet, put like the little stuff in there. I had some, a few little things like medical wise that wouldn't really fit in a bigger tote. So I thought these are cute and I can just stack them on the shelf instead of having to put like little small boxes because I don't have enough, I, I don't know where you can buy extra shelves for something like that, what I have. I have like a cabinet. So I thought these would be cute to stack in there. A little design that is so adorable. I love these little, little designs on them. I think they're just fun. I think they're fun. To go along with that theme of the boxes and the colors and the utility room closet, I got these. These are bigger. They are bigger than those. Same design. They didn't have it in the blue. So I just went ahead and got these two. There was only two of these. So I got them. I guess everybody else liked them too. But I can stack these as well and put them in there and hold a lot more than some just one basket. They're, they've got, they're super handy. Go to your Dollar Tree and get these. They are great. There was actually a lady, an older lady actually, who was looking for a tote to put her medical supplies in. I thought it was so cute. She was old and she was like, I really need something for my medical supplies. And I need something for like my bandages and my ointments. And I said, well, sweetie, get one of these. This is a good size. Get a couple of those. Put them in your closet. And then just put a little label on it and says, ointments, bandages, whatever else you got to have for medical. I don't really know. But um, yeah, I was like, get those. My brownies are going off. My buzzer's going off. Ah. Okay, my brownies were not done. I had to put them in for two more minutes. So I got two minutes. I was out of fabric softener. So I thought, while well, I'm there, I'll pick one up. Didn't have to go to Walmart, so that's good. It's right here. Nothing, it's nothing spectacular. I was out, so I got it. This one is the Morning Sun scent. 
it's okay. The last thing I got was kind of a, oh, let's just see if it works type of thing. It's called the Ultimate Bra Strap Solution. And it comes in three different colors. You get black, white, and tan. And it's supposed to conceal your bra straps, instant lift and support, improve posture. Okay, we'll see, right? So see, they, here they are, and they come so that it does, so it does like that. You put your, put your bra straps together underneath like a shirt like that, or even a sports bra, because I mean, sports bras, they're not very supportive. You know what I'm saying? So um, this would be good to have. That's my Dollar Tree haul for the day. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks.